Hey guys, it's Amber from Amber Plans Her Day, and I wanted to come on and do a faith plan with me for the week of February 10th through the 16th. So make sure you stay tuned. This week, I wanted to focus on the Brights Mega Value Pack sticker book. It comes with a hundred sticker sheets. It was released in 2019 and this is the Brights one so it's full of bright colors and fun quotes. So I'm thinking I'll play off of the rainbow theme that's already in here and I saw these really fun looking boxes and I'm thinking the best option is to put them up here where I put my lyrics. Ooh, but now I'm thinking not. Now I'm thinking maybe just right here in rainbow and I'll like put something that sticks out to me each day from the song. If they were slightly bigger, I would have put them up here, but I don't know if I really love the way that they fit down there. Unfortunately, there is no true purple. Um, as I've kind of been trying to come out with a little bit more, but we'll just kind of go with what we have in the sticker book. And then we'll just play off of those colors. And then I'm thinking the blue purple. Well, I'm thinking we'll do this color actually to kind of tie it all together. Okay instead of doing a pink at the end. I don't really like it when people do pink at the end. That's not me at all. Oopsies. I hope I didn't ruin that sticker. Oh yeah, that will come up easy. Sweet. Sometimes these stickers do not come up easy. I'm sure you guys have seen me fight stickers before. But. And I'm thinking something else that would be really fun to do to tie it in is use the small boxes the lyrics up top so we'll go ahead and put them right here where I usually just write what song I listen to that day that will also tie in that rainbow theme there okay yellow orange and the reddish it's kind of like a muted red color That one's kind of, oh, I guess they all are. Okay, come over here. This one seemed like it was miscut a little bit just because there's barely any on the top. It looks like it was probably still miscut, but they're all like small color at the top. Perfect. So got a little bit of a rainbow theme going on there. For the rest of it, I probably won't worry about like, well, let's see what colors we have in here. Um, I'm thinking a like rainbow quote, maybe a couple rainbow quotes. That one's perfect, that one's fun. See the light, travel light, live the light, be the light, spread the light. I'm thinking I might just put that on Tuesday. And then color your world with kindness. She has fire in her soul, grace. She has fire in her soul. Grace flows abundantly from her heart. She's brave and kind. Her heart is true. She lives her purpose every day. She inspires hope and leads with her brilliant light. I think that is beautiful for my faith planner. And I'm thinking we'll put that on Saturday. That won't leave me tons of room to journal, but I think that it's okay. Some days I have way more that I want to journal. And then some days it's like, yeah, nah, I'd rather not. Okay. And then I wanted to do these rainbows. I think those are really fun. Maybe I'll put them on the top. 
since there's plenty. And I'll just put it all along the top of the page. All right, let's make sure I get that. So hard to make sure. Beautiful. Oopsies. Come on, there we go. Let's try to get that. Okay. And then this one I'm gonna have to cut. Where will I cut it at though? Okay, cut it right about there. Just make sure. That's right on, perfect, and then fun. Let's go ahead and do the same thing on this side. Go ahead and just put that down. I'll use these last two. Down there, perfect. This one's crooked. I don't know if you can really tell. And then one more. I'm just gonna lay it down and then I'll cut off excess after the fact. Oh, and there's barely any excess, so that's perfect. Oh, okay. This one is gonna bother me if it's gonna be that crooked. <laughs> oh, look, I ripped it. Let's see if we can salvage it. I think I can, because I didn't rip it bad. I just need to get it down, but, which is the hardest part. Okay, much better. Like, way better. <laughs> way more content with that. Okay. It's been a while since I've done a good rainbow spread. So this is really fun. I'm looking for a box to cover up that section since I don't use it. Usually like to have a box quote that covers it up. Didn't see anything I was in love with on that side. Um, I could do like something like this since it matches those and then have it be like something that I write in there. And then maybe should I tie this in on the other side too? I guess why not? I'll just put it down there too. Yeah, that's okay. That's all right. Okay. Let's see what else we've got. Um. I love all these, like, I love the rainbow. So I just want to see what else there is, maybe about the rainbow. And then there's the floors. Okay. I did see something up here. These ones. Today. Fun times, happy plans, focus on you. So I got four to use and I'm just kind of going to put them around. Perfect. And close that up. 
and I really like that. Um, I want something up here that like reminds me to like remember or something. I feel like there's got to be something big work schedule this week's top priorities. Um, okay. I always forget this one has two of every single page. So if you guys don't have this sticker book, it's a really simple one to know because every other page is the same. So like here you have this page. Let's see if I can get it right there. So work hard and be nice, current mood, happy, the discs. And then right here on the second page, it is the same exact sticker page. Same with these florals, right? So you have the pink and the blue one, pink and the blue one. They're the same exact. So that's how you know which sticker, like these mega sticker books. Um, some people love that. Some people wish that they would have put more, I guess, time and made a hundred different pages instead of two of every other. But I like... I like it the way it is because sometimes one page is foiled and one page is not. Sometimes um, you have um, sometimes you have like one page of clear and one page not. So like this is actually a clear page and this is actually matte. So they're actually the same stickers, but one is clear, one is matte. So I like it the way that it is, and they do have some variation into it. So I like that. And I wanna see if there's anything else that I wanted to just add. I think that might be it. And then I'll just walk you through what I use this spread for. Let's go ahead and put this back. There we go. So you guys can see that. Quote two. So this is my faith planner. This is a worship song journal. Basically, up here in these rainbow small boxes, I will put the name of the song that I listened to that day. In this box down here, in the middle section, I will put the lyrics that stood out to me the most. Down here in these rainbow boxes, I will just maybe put like one word or something that's like really powerful to me in that day or a verse that's like related to the song or whatever. And then in the bottom section, I will journal about the song and how it applies to my life and what it means to me and like just the truth behind it. Over here in this column, I have been using it for a memory verse. So I'm going on a mission trip this summer with my church. And that is where I write down the verse that I want to memorize for that week. So when I'm out there, I can share it because I'll have it in my memory. Um, I try to leave as much room for journaling as possible. You can see this week, this day has barely any. This day is less than. This stays little, but I also have that box to add to it. So I try to make sure that there's plenty of room to journal about, um, but that's how I kind of use my faith planner. So let's pop her back into the planner. There we go. And then this side. Thank you guys so much for watching my plan with me in my classic Faith Happy Planner that I use as a worship journal. This week I use the Bright Mega Value Pack Sticker Book to create a rainbow type of spread. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope that you will continue to follow along as I plan a happy life and continue to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel.